Hey everyone, imagine going on an adventure to the deepest part of our planet, a place that's super dark and crazy hot. Picture yourself descending into the Earth's crust, where the temperature rises with every mile you go down. It's a journey that takes you through layers of rock that have been around for millions, even billions of years. These rocks hold the secrets of our planet's history from the time it was formed to the present day. It's like traveling back in time, one layer at a time. Think about going down miles below the surface into a place where the rocks themselves tell stories about Earth's really old past. Each layer of rock is like a page in a history book filled with information about the conditions on Earth at the time it was formed. Scientists study these layers to learn about everything from ancient climates to the movements of tectonic plates. It's a fascinating and challenging field of study that requires a lot of specialized equipment and expertise. That's the cool thing about the Kola Superdeep Borehole. It shows how curious we humans are and how much we want to explore the unknown. This borehole is the deepest man-made hole on Earth, reaching over 12 kilometers into the ground. It was a massive project that took decades to complete and involved scientists and engineers from all over the world. The goal was to learn more about the Earth's crust and the processes that shape our planet. The Kola Superdeep Borehole is a really amazing feat of engineering and science, and it's located in a remote part of Russia. The project started in the 1970s, during the Cold War, when there was a lot of competition between countries to make scientific and technological advancements. Despite the political tensions, the scientists working on the borehole were focused on their mission to uncover the mysteries of the Earth's interior. They faced many challenges, from technical difficulties to extreme temperatures, but they persevered and made some incredible discoveries. It's like a doorway to the mysterious inside of our planet, a place where secrets about how Earth formed and changed are hidden. The core samples brought up from the borehole have provided valuable insights into the composition and structure of the Earth's crust. Scientists have found evidence of ancient microbial life, discovered new types of minerals, and gained a better understanding of the geothermal gradient. These findings have helped to advance our knowledge of geology and have implications for everything from natural resource exploration to understanding natural hazards. This is the story of that journey, a journey that started during a time of competition between countries and still amazes people today. The Kola Superdeep Borehole is a testament to human curiosity and determination. It shows what we can achieve when we set our minds to exploring the unknown and pushing the boundaries of our knowledge. Even though the project has ended, the data and samples collected continue to be studied and provide new insights. The journey to the Earth's core is far from over and who knows what other secrets we might uncover in the future. Back in the 1960s and 1970s, the United States and the Soviet Union were in a big competition, like a race to space. This period, known as the Cold War, saw both superpowers vying for supremacy in various fields. The space race was one of the most visible aspects of this rivalry, with each nation striving to outdo the other in a bid to demonstrate their technological and ideological superiority. The launch of Sputnik by the Soviet Union in 1957 had already set the stage, and the United States responded with the Apollo missions, culminating in the historic moon landing in 1969. But the competition didn't stop at space. It extended to a race to build weapons, with both nations amassing vast arsenals of nuclear weapons and other advanced military technologies. This arms race was fueled by a mutual fear and distrust, leading to an era of unprecedented military build-up. The Cuban Missile Crisis of 1962 brought the world to the brink of nuclear war, highlighting the dangers of this intense rivalry. Beyond the military and space arenas, there was also a race to be the best in science and technology. Both nations invested heavily in scientific research, seeking to make groundbreaking discoveries that would not only advance human knowledge but also provide strategic advantages. This period saw significant advancements in fields such as computer science, medicine and materials science. It was during this time that the Kola Superdeep Borehole project began. Initiated by the Soviet Union in 1970, this ambitious project aimed to drill as deep as possible into the Earth's crust to study its composition and understand the geological processes at work. The project represented a significant scientific endeavor, pushing the limits of drilling technology and human ingenuity. Both countries put a lot of effort into science, each wanting to be better than the other to show off their skills. 
and make their country proud. This drive for scientific excellence was not just about national pride. It was also about demonstrating the superiority of their respective political and economic systems. The United States with its capitalist model and the Soviet Union with its communist ideology each sought to prove that their way of life was the best. The United States started Project Moholi, trying to drill through the Earth's crust to reach the Moho, which is like the border between the crust and the mantle. This project, initiated in the early 1960s, aimed to provide valuable scientific data about the Earth's interior. Although it faced numerous technical challenges and was eventually abandoned, Project Mohole set the stage for future deep-sea drilling endeavors. Not wanting to be outdone, the Soviet Union started their own deep drilling project, the Kola Super Deep Borehole. This project, which continued for over two decades, ultimately reached a depth of over 12 kilometers, making it the deepest artificial point on Earth. The Kola Superdeep Borehole provided valuable scientific insights and remains a testament to the ambitious spirit of the Cold War era. In 1970, in a really cold and remote part of Russia called the Kola Peninsula, Soviet scientists and engineers started a journey into the unknown. Their goal was to drill deeper into the Earth than anyone ever had before, hoping to uncover the secrets hidden deep inside. The Kola Super Deep Borehole Project showed how clever and determined humans can be. It was a huge task that would push the limits of drilling technology and give us valuable information about what our planet is made of, how it's structured and its history. As the drill went deeper and deeper into the Earth's crust, it found all sorts of rock formations. These formations were not just random. They were like pages in a history book each one telling a unique story about the Earth's past. The deeper the drill went, the older the stories became, revealing secrets that had been buried for millions, even billions of years. That told a story billions of years old. Each layer of rock was like a time capsule, preserving evidence of ancient environments. These layers showed us how the climate has changed over eons, how life has evolved, and how catastrophic events like volcanic eruptions and asteroid impacts have left their mark on our planet. Big shifts in the Earth's plates and the slow processes that have shaped our planet. The movement of tectonic plates, for instance, has created mountains, ocean basins and continents. Over millions of years, these movements have caused earthquakes, volcanic eruptions and the formation of new land masses. The Kola Super Deep Borehole became a window into the Earth's distant past, giving scientists an amazing look at the geological processes. This project, which aimed to drill as deep as possible into the Earth's crust, reached depths of over 12 kilometers. It provided invaluable data that helped scientists understand the composition and structure of the Earth's interior. That have made our world what it is. The project gave us a ton of data, revealing the existence of ancient, tiny fossils. These fossils, some of which were microscopic, offered clues about the earliest forms of life on Earth. They helped scientists piece together the puzzle of how life began and evolved over billions of years. Unexpected rocks that contain water and changes in seismic activity, the discovery of water in rocks deep below the surface was particularly surprising. It suggested that water might be more widespread within the Earth's crust than previously thought, which has implications for our understanding of geological processes and the potential for life in extreme environments. That challenged what we thought we knew about geology. The data from the Kola Superdeep Borehole forced scientists to re-evaluate many of their theories about the Earth's interior. It showed that our planet is more complex and dynamic than we ever imagined, and that there is still much to learn about the forces that have shaped it over billions of years. One of the most amazing discoveries from the Kola Superdeep Borehole Project was finding microscopic fossils inside the rock layers. These tiny leftovers of ancient life, preserved for billions of years deep within the Earth, gave us exciting clues about how life first appeared on our planet. Just as surprising was finding water at depths where we didn't think it could exist. Finding water miles below the surface, trapped within the rocks, challenged our understanding of how water is spread throughout the Earth and made us wonder if life could exist in such extreme environments. 
Drilling to such incredible depths wasn't easy at all. As the drill went deeper into the Earth's crust, the temperature and pressure went way up. These extreme conditions pushed drilling technology to its limits, forcing scientists to invent new materials and techniques to deal with the heat, pressure, and wear and tear. Keeping the borehole from collapsing was a constant challenge. The weight of the drilling mud used to help the drill bit and carry rock pieces back up put a huge amount of pressure on the borehole's walls. Preventing a collapse under these conditions required smart engineering and constant attention. In the early 1990s, after more than 20 years of drilling, the Kola Superdeep Borehole Project ran into some big problems. The Soviet Union had collapsed, leaving the project without its main source of money. Plus, the extreme temperatures at the bottom of the borehole, over 350 degrees Fahrenheit, were too much for the drilling technology to handle. Because of these challenges, they decided to stop drilling. The Kola Superdeep Borehole reaching a depth of over seven and a half miles was sealed with a metal cap, marking the end of an era of exploration. Even though the Kola Superdeep borehole is sealed up now, its impact continues. The project stands as a reminder of human curiosity, ingenuity, and the pursuit of scientific knowledge. Scientists all over the world are still studying the data collected during the project, learning more about what our planet is made of, how it's structured, and how it has changed over time. The Kola Superdeep borehole taught us that the inside of the Earth is much more complicated and active than we once thought. It showed us ancient life at depths where we thought it couldn't exist, and it challenged our understanding of how water is distributed within the Earth's crust. The Kola Superdeep borehole might be sealed, but our desire to explore the Earth's depths is as strong as ever. Scientists and engineers worldwide are creating new technologies and techniques to overcome the difficulties of deep drilling, hoping to uncover the secrets still hidden within our planet. From the deepest parts of the oceans to the heart of continents, exploring the Earth's interior promises to reveal new discoveries that will change our understanding of Earth's past, present and future. As we venture deeper into the unknown, we can only imagine the amazing things we'll find. And that's how they finally sealed the deepest hole on Earth. If you enjoyed this deep dive into the mysteries beneath our feet, be sure to check out our next video. Who knows what other secrets the Earth is hiding? Share your thoughts in the comments below and don't forget to like, subscribe and follow for more thrilling tech and trek adventures.